Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to discuss a poem, I Shall Go Back in the New Year, written by an Assami writer, Neelim Kumar. It is prescribed for the first semester BCA and BSc students, Bangalore University and Bangalore North University. This poem is about New Year and a New Year resolutions. So we see people having different kinds of resolutions every year. We see some people having resolutions to quit smoking. We see some people having resolutions to study well. There are different kinds of resolutions that we see every year, right? But in this poem, the poet Neelim Kumar has very interesting resolutions for the new year. Now let us get into the poem and let's see what are the resolutions that the poet has for the new year. In the new year, everybody wants to go forward in life. But the poet Neelim Kumar wants to go backward. What does that mean? That means the poet wants to follow the lifestyle of the past. See, many people think of buying a vehicle in the new year. Some people think of buying a car. Some people think of buying a two-wheeler. But instead of buying new vehicles, the poet wants to sell his two cars. And he wants to buy a cycle, bicycle. He does not want to be advanced. He does not want to go forward. He wants to go backward. There must be a reason for going backward in his life. So now we'll uh, see some more resolutions in the next stanza. In the next stanza, we understand that many people think of building a new house or buying a new flat. But instead of buying a new flat or building a new house, the poet Neelim Kumar wants to demolish his concrete wall. He wants to demolish his concrete wall and he wants to build a bamboo fence. Why does he want to do so? Because he feels that bamboo fence is better than the concrete wall. He wants to do so because the air passes through the bamboo fence so easily. And it, he can feel that fresh air, the cool breeze. That's the reason he wants to demolish that concrete wall. In the next stanza, we understand that many people think of buying new things in the new year. For example, some people may think of buying a TV. Some people may think of buying a smartwatch. At least an Android mobile phone. But the poet Neelim Kumar, instead of buying a new smartphone or Android phone, he just wants to change his cracked screen card of his old handset, which he had bought for 800 rupees. So he just wants to change the screen card of that. He does not want to buy a new cell phone. So that's his next uh, resolution. And he also says that he would not get his eyes tested. He would not invest so much money on the spectacles. He would just go to the fancy bazaar. He would buy a Chinese reading glasses. That's it. In the next stanza, we understand that the poet would throw away all the porcelain utensils that he has. And he would throw away all the spoons, glass tumblers. He would just get a plantain leaf, banana leaf and he would eat with his fingers. And he also says that he would take off his shoes and sandals and he would remain barefooted. So that's what he says in this stanza. And in the last stanza, the poet gives the reason why he does not want to go forward in his life. According to him, if you want to go forward in your life, you need to tell so many lies. In every work, there are many lies. If you want to progress, you need to tell lies. So the poet does not want that kind of progress. So he decides to go backward. So these are the resolutions that the poet has for the new year. So with this, we are done with this poem. Thank you.